Emily Bloom here filling in for Mark Peterson as he enjoys this Friday off. Now, as we move into this afternoon and this evening, uh, pretty warm conditions, all things considered. We're going to be up to about 36, 37 degrees, depending upon where exactly you're at in the Spokane region. And we're tracking some rain showers that are going to be moving in about 3 or 4 p.m. Pretty widespread and it's areas north of us that are going to see um, mostly snow with this system. Here in Spokane, it's going to start out as rain. But as we move into the evening hours and temperatures drop into those lower 30s, we could see a little bit of snowfall. If there's any kind of accumulation, it's not going to amount to much. Uh, you can see back down to about 32 degrees as we head into the evening hours tonight. Now as we track this all out, you can see that widespread activity, Colville, Bonners, Fa Bonners Ferry, Sandpoint, looking like mostly snow for you at this point. Uh, here in the Spokane area, strictly rain at about that 5 p.m. But then once we get into 10 or 11, we could, the system could move out of the Spokane area with some snow. Uh, as I mentioned, if we see any kind of accumulation, it's not going to amount much. We clear everything out on Saturday, but then on Sunday we have got round two. Now if you or anybody you know is traveling home this weekend, tomorrow is going to be the day to do it. What we're seeing with this system, uh, we do have a weather alert day in effect. It's going to be heavy snow and gusty winds. It's going to impact all area mountain passes Saturday night into Sunday. Uh, winter driving conditions, it's not going to be good through these passes. So as I mentioned, those who are going to be traveling home, you're gonna to wanna to try and do it tomorrow or even into Monday. Uh, Snoqualmie Pass, looking okay today through tomorrow, not so much on Sunday. Uh, same situation with Stevens Pass, Lookout and 4th of July Pass, uh, same story. So wanna make sure that those of you who are getting home are able to do so safely and uh, it's not looking so promising on Sunday at the moment. Uh, four day forecast is showing that by Monday we'll have a little bit of sunshine and things will um, probably be looking a whole lot better in terms of snow and temperatures though, at that point, a little bit cooler for us. I'm Emily Bloom, I hope you have a great weekend.